topic is what it is. Just cheating, okay? I swear I love, I know that I love her. The way she feels all on the cover. The way she make it seem all on the cover. Hey, what's going on, Army family? I'm back with another video, guys. Hey, hey. Hey, if this is your first time watching our video, guys, I'm Rayon. And I'm Brittany, and welcome, and welcome to our YouTube, YouTube channel, channel. So, guys. guys, today we got something interesting going on. We're in the kitchen with it. Yeah, no Popeyes tonight. No Popeyes tonight. We cooking. What are you making, baby? What we're making, baby. What we're making, yes. So, guys, tonight is date night. Typically, date nights, we'll normally do, like, we'll cook together. We'll do something, like, fun that we like to do, and then we'll just cook together. So tonight, guys, we have pizza. I'm making homemade pizza, and we normally would get like we normally would do like wings, but Rayon. What well, Rayon? What? He wants cracked chicken. So they don't know what cracked chicken is, guys. Do you think know they what do? Chicken is coming down with know what cracked chicken is. I think they do. I think only people that's behaving may know what cracked chicken is. You didn't know what cracked chicken was? No, no, until so you told me. For real? No. Oh. So yeah, guys. So cracked chicken is. Basically. basically what chicken breast it, yeah it's basically chicken breast um you do like in an egg and flour batter and then you can make like a cracked chicken burger or cracked chicken and fries or whatever i didn't know i don't think so Rayon. Yeah. really and then uh you get this little yeah you have to like beat it beat it thin 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 yeah, thin thin, thin. Right like thin as hell yeah you gotta beat it beat up the chicken breast yeah and so right now guys what i'm doing is just um spreading up the Pizza dough. Pizza dough. So we're making it right, cracked chicken and pizzas. And um, some fries. Yeah. Cut up some fries already. Yeah guys, you all know I love fries. Oh. So. Alright. So basically our topic is what baby? So yeah, um is cheating okay? I don't know. Cheating, cheating okay. me, I'm the type of person when it comes to cheating, cheating is just something that I don't tolerate. Like I don't I I just I feel like cheating is like you go so far to the point where it's like, I feel like there's no return. If that makes sense. Like that's the type of person I am. I feel like you betrayed my trust so much to the point where it's like, I don't think I would never be able to look at you the same or anything like that. Unless it's like, you know, it's a situation where you have kids and stuff like that. I know it's a little bit harder, but other than that, no. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think I don't think like it's like why though. Yeah, I'm not, I don't I, I don't stand for cheating as well. Oh, I don't know why, but um, I don't stand for cheating as well because it's like to me it's like basically starting a project and then like turning it back on the project. Like you put all this work into you know something and then it's like oh you just mess it up like that. But I mean I don't think a lot of people have the intentions of, of cheating though. You know? What What do you mean by that? Maybe some people just I don't know. Maybe they just don't know how to control themselves. They might get too drunk. But like then it's like, why it. put yourself in a situation? You might hang around their own crowd. But that's what I'm saying. That means you just gotta know your strength. You gotta know your limits, limitation. You know. But what did I always tell you? Though? What do I always tell you about me? Oh. Like I never, will you, never. You would never put yourself in a situation where you have to like explain, explain myself. I'm never gonna put myself in a situation where it's like I feel like I'm gonna have to explain myself. Like if let's just say me and Rayon, me and Rayon are doing something, right? And let's just say Rayon is out of town for work, right? And I go with one of my friends. Cheese on here? You ate it all. <laughs> and let's just say Rayon, and I'm out with my friends and we go out to like, let's just say a party or whatever. I would never put myself in a situation where I, someone could possibly take a photo of me and, of me with a whole bunch of guys around and let's just say it's an inappropriate type of situation. You know what I'm saying? And then someone sends it to Rayon, then I'm gonna have to explain myself. Oh, no, 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 this was what was happening, and this was what happened. No, I'm not gonna put myself in that type of situation. You need this for the pot, right? The juice. No, uh -uh. Basically, like, that's what I mean. So, it's just like, when I hear people talk about, oh, I was in a, I got drunk, or when I got this, or that, I just feel like it's an excuse. Yeah. That's how I look at it. I just feel like it's an excuse. We are all accountable for our actions, and you're, we're all accountable for our for what happens after our actions. You get what I'm saying? Well, if you won't be man enough, if you won't be man enough or woman enough to go to go hang out with your friends and go and get drunk and then whatever happens happens, then you should be man enough to be able to deal with the consequences after it. That's true. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no honest stuff about it. That's true. 
first time to the moon. Guys, right now, what I did was I saved a little bit of ground turkey, and what I did was I just put up some spinach, um, some sweet peppers, and some onions, and I'm just gonna put that on top of there. This is for my pizza. pizza. Ooh, so we got a healthy pizza coming up, too. Yeah. Wow. Because it's like, a lot of people like to call themselves, oh, I'm a man, mm -hmm. or I'm a woman, but you gotta understand it comes with responsibility, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So it's like, you do have control over certain situations in your life. And exactly. you do have control over your life. You never hear people be like, oh, um, in the wrong place at the wrong time. Mm -hmm. That is kind of true, but you had you had the choice to say whether I should have should have went or not. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yes, you you don't control what happens while you're there, but you made the decision to go. Mm -hmm. If you know that you wasn't supposed to go, it's kind of like it's kind of like just going outside, walking around for no reason. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You never hear people say, don't put yourself in situations unless you have to. Mm -hmm. kind, of, kind of like that. I don't know if it makes sense, but kind of like that. But yeah, though, so. Um, Wait, don't put that all over you, but we gotta use the chicken. <laughs> Guys, right now I just literally like cleaned the whole kitchen. And I just want to say something about that too. You know, like when you like, it's like an equal partnership. It's like if he's cooking, I'll wash the dishes. And if I'm cooking, he'll wash the dishes. It's like, it's not like, oh, what's his job or what's my job? It's like we equally. And then we Rayon, equally eat too. <laughs> he eats up all the stuff. <laughs> so that's the part that's all me. Yeah, and then I make my own sauce, guys, for my pizza sauce. I make my own pizza okay. sauce. Guys, as y'all know, I love the kitchen. Like, I literally love the kitchen. And guys, you guys have been asking me for the Johnny Cake recipe. Oh, yeah, that's I need soul. to do that. That is coming soon. All right, baby. So let me just put this on here. You ask the next question, baby. So, yeah, so I was saying, um, so, yeah, so what you said, I 100% agree with it. Mm -hmm. I don't agree with chicken, and you should be held responsible for your, for your actions, mm -hmm. right? So, how do you feel about forgiving someone after cheating? Or would you take somebody back after cheating? Could you, li could you live with something like that? That's what I'm saying. To me, it's like once once that's done, done. It's hard. It's hard. Yeah, I feel like I'm the same way too. I ain't about to. It's hard. Because let's just say I was to go out and go cheat on you. It was a complete accident. Or let's just say me and you are not are not good. And let's just say I go out and I go cheat on you. I don't have no emotions at that point. It's like I'm not thinking. I'm just you know doing what I do. Would you be able to look at me the same? I don't know. That's what I thought. I don't know what I can answer that. Uh-huh. To me, I don't know. I think it's done. That's how I feel too. I feel like... I don't think I, I'm able to live with myself. Properly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I feel like I'm gonna have to forgive you. But, let's just say you take somebody back after cheating. Would you be able to not bring it up though? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. That's the hard like, let's part. Let's just say you, you they kind of moving a little, like not not they moving suspicious, but they moving out, they moving, but you think it's suspicious, mm -hmm. but y'all over that though. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like it's okay to bring that up after you already forgive? See, that's the oh, thing forget, though. Forget. That's the thing with when you're in a situation like like when you're in a relationship where one person has cheated, it's kind of hard because it's like you can't you can't move on from that situation and always bring it up. You're always bringing it up, always bringing bring it, up. it up. It's like, it's like, do I bring it up? Or or every time he starts moving Cause, funny, cause I'm gonna just keep on thinking about that. Because if you bring it up, then it start a whole lot of argument. Exactly. And it's like, that stuff up. I, I thought we was game. over that. Right, I thought we was over that. Yeah, exactly. It's just a messy situation, boy. That's why I'm saying, like, when it comes to, like, cheating, like, I'm just talking about, like, cheating in me and Rayon's relationship right now. Me and Rayon are like this. Me and Rayon, like I said, like we said before, when we first started dating, me and Rayon used to argue about the Silly your stuff. Dumbest? Dumbest. <laughs> Sometimes the same thing like we said before, the same thing, but we just saying it in different ways. In different ways. And it's just like, like now, the type of connection me and him have and the type of love that me and him have, if I was to step out on him and he was to feel as if like he would never be able to trust me again or look at me the same way again, I would totally you understand. I totally understand. Or if he was to do that to me and I would not be able to love him the same way ever again. Right, I would have to understand. Exactly. Not saying that I would not love him anymore, but the love that I had for him and the way that I looked at him will totally change. 
You know what I mean? Because when someone tells you that they hold your heart, they hold you, they hold their heart in your hands, and they love you so much, it's like, okay, if you love me so much, why do you want to see me through so much pain? That's true. Anything you want to do over there? No, baby. I just want to do this first. What do you, how do you feel about the situation? About um, cheating and taking someone back? Yeah. I agree with you 100% on that. That's mm -hmm. wow. Because for me, it's like, once the relationship change, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to trust you again. Because me, I'm the type of person you you saw how I was when, when we first met, and I told you like, and I told and I told Brittany straight, I don't trust you know, like like not not to say I don't trust girls, but my trust like I just don't give up my trust like that. So once my trust is broken, that's it. Not to say that I'm not gonna talk to you ever again. I'm gonna talk to you, mm -hmm. but I'm just gonna know how to move with you. You know what I'm saying? And it's never gonna be the same because. I already know what was done, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm gonna forgive you or whatever, but we, we may not be together though. Or even if we are together, it, it might be different and then eventually the relationship might just... It's gonna be hard for me. I'm telling you that right now. It's gonna be hard for me. Especially when it's you go with someone at such a high standard. Yeah, it's gonna be hard for me. Oh, that piece of good. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right, so you know what? Let's finish doing this first, and then when we're done, yeah. we're gonna bring it back. Okay. It's good? All right. Yeah. Put that in there for me. The pizza in the oven, almost ready. Ooh. Guys, now that I'm thinking about it, I feel like we should have done the burgers. All right, baby, put that one in there. The burger. The so crack chicken burger. Put that one in there. Guys, we're gonna be running through the fire. <laughs> so guys, I beat them with this. And then I just did like a little bit of like little chicken bites. That was it. And then some of them I just did. <laughs> Alright, so we're almost there. Chicken. Sprinkle a little flour on it. <laughs> nah. I got me some fries. Y'all know I like fries, so that's why they're fries. And then this is the delicious pizza. So guys, this is the end of this video. Beautiful. Now we're about to enjoy our night. Yes, our date, date night. night. So guys, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um we want you guys to come to our channel and like laugh and stuff at our pranks and stuff like that. But we also want you guys to be able to come and be able to like, you know. Get some advice from us. Yeah. Advice, yeah. He can't even talk. Uh -huh. He always eat it. But that hot, babe. Look, no, that hot. hot. Okay. Yes, it was hot. I was gonna say, but you can't turn it down. No, it's not that hot. No, 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 no. You're looking at me. No. Mm -mm. It's not that hot. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm -mm. Y'all, bring me fried. She be eating too. No. Anyways, guys. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. video. And at 5k, don't forget guys, at 5k we will 5K be doing, doing another, another giveaway. Big, big giveaway. Yes. Yeah, Alright guys, so make sure y'all share this video, like, comment, share, subscribe. He can't turn it down. <laughs> All that good stuff. Why are you coping like that? Alright guys. That's how we got him. Alright guys. Alright guys, so until next time. Please, Peace. make sure you like, like comment, share, and subscribe. subscribe. And if you don't hit welcome to the Army family, we out. Yeah. Please.